Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, we're going to do a quarantine day in my life. You guys will get to see what I do during this pandemic. Today is Monday, so it's a work day. So you guys are gonna see what I do today. Uh, typically, I wake up around nine o'clock, 9.14, so I legit just woke up. I think my phone's like telling me good morning. So it's 9.15, I usually get up around this time. I don't usually go back to bed, not gonna lie. And I get up. Um, freshen up, get some breakfast, and then I start work. Um, usually on Monday mornings, I might have conference meetings with my manager and my coworkers. So, um, if that is the case, then you guys will get to see that. Um, yeah, so let's get our day started. Okay, so I changed my clothes and everything, and this is some workout clothes because after work I'm gonna do a workout. And now I am gonna do my skincare routine. Already showered up. So, just brushing my teeth, do my skincare, make some breakfast really quickly, and then I have to hop on and get to work. Um, it is, I don't have my phone with me, but it's probably like 10.30, so I only have 30 minutes. Okay. So now I'm about to do a really quick skincare routine, um, just to freshen up my face and stuff like that. Um, definitely let me know down in the comments below if you guys want an in-depth tutorial. Well, not a tutorial, but my skincare routine. I get a lot of questions on like how I get my skin so clear. Um, to be honest with you, I'm not gonna lie, it's genetic, but um, I do have a skincare routine. So if you guys wanna see that, let me know. Just finished the last little bit that was in there, didn't you? Because you froze the milk. Uh, I froze that milk. That's why I ate it. Because if, if I had left it out so long and it got milk. I was going to have cereal, but he froze the milk. Okay, so I just had breakfast. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to like tighten up my room. Um, like make up my bed and stuff. I usually do work on my bed, not on my desk. Um, because of the type of chair that I have. I have a um, beauty salon chair, so... It, there's no support for my back, so I usually do my work on my bed, so I'm going to do that now. Hi. 
<laughs> I didn't even know you were filming at this time. Oh, okay. So what are you doing today? So acting so awkward. Get out. <laughs> now she told me to get out of her room. I'm her mother, okay? So I didn't even know she was doing all of this. You're sitting and then there was listening to my whole conversation You're too. You're sitting on my bed and you just ruined <laughs> Bye. I had a conference meeting today. So we'll see. Just to give you guys a little bit of what I do for work, I work in adult education um, at, at the Brooklyn Public Library at one of the branches. Um, and there, I normally schedule people for the TAC exam. The TAS was repli replaced the GED, so I schedule patrons for that exam. However, because our facilities are closed, I can't schedule people for the TAC exam. So what I'm doing is I'm organizing and holding virtual screenings, meetings, um, answering emails regarding our classes and services for our adult education program. So that's what I'm doing now. That's not not something that I normally do, but you know because I can't. But I normally do because or if it's closed, I have to do this. So this is what I'm doing now. Just um, I do have a virtual schedule. So like today I work from eleven to five. I'm not gonna work till eleven to five. My hours are definitely going to be reduced because it's not a lot for me to do anyway. But I still get paid for the full five hours, which is good. So I'm still doing work. I manager just texted me to update a couple of things on these google sheets that i have so i'm going to be doing that now and then once i'm done with work i'm gonna figure out the next thing i want to do today um i'm supposed to be helping my mom out and her friend with some type of like music thing or whatever um yeah so that's what i'm going to do Honestly, today is not going to be very productive just because I don't have a lot to do today. Like I said, not a lot of work for me to do. Um, it's like a very chill day. Nothing really productive to do. I'm not going out. I haven't been out in like a month. Um, so we're just going to have to find a couple of things to do. I think I'm going to start a new book read today. I'm trying to really get back into my reading. I was a huge, huge, huge bookworm in high school. And I think it's so ironic that I work at the library now. And so I have all, nothing but uh, books around me. Even though I don't work in the library section, I work in the, um, work in the office upstairs. So I don't do work with anything that has to do with books. But I just think that's so funny. What time your class start? What time it end? What time are you going to sleep for? Okay, I'll call you after your class. I need to get him off the phone because I want to listen to some music. Sorry, okay. What's up, y'all? So, it's currently 8.38. I'm going to be completely honest. I slept the entire day. Um, which is my typical quarantine day in my life. I sleep all day when I don't have anything else to do. Or I watch, like, movies. Um, or watch like a TV show or something like that. I'm about to get me some breakfast, but right now I am watching the Babyface versus Teddy Riley live on Instagram. Um, it's hilarious. I'll show you guys a little bit of it. He just keep having all type of difficulties. <laughs> I didn't get to watch the first live that they did where it had all the technical difficulties. Ooh. I didn't get to watch the first one when it was actually happening, but I watched some of it on YouTube today because someone recorded it. 
and posted it on YouTube. So I watched it. All right, guys, this ends the vlog for today. Quarantine day in my life. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I know it wasn't really that interesting and fun, but um, this is what I typically do during this quarantine situation. I am making my promise and uploading a lot more on YouTube. So kudos to me for that. Thank you guys for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one.